So, nice thing about chiropractic students, they do really well at relaxing. There it is. I think I'm gonna cry. Yeah, I'm gonna Why? cry. <laughs> this has been a while. It just felt like a lot of relief. <laughs> wow. Oh, everything's so much brighter. I got a little bit tears. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cow, that's crazy. That's a different type of adjustment I've ever felt. That was so specific and great, dude. That was awesome. Look up as high as you can. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I just knew that was way more. <laughs> this here in this moment, that relief from that one adjustment just made it all just seem like it was way better. Alrighty, so we got future Dr. De La Torre. The reason why I say that is because he's actually a chiropractic student coming in here, trying to get his, bo his body aligned so that we can serve people in the future here soon. So let us know what's all bringing you in today. Uh, I've been having a lot of like chest pain. Uh, my heart's been hurting on the left side, um, but then I've also had like a lot of like stiffness and tightness on my upper thoracic and then lower cervical area. So uh, just here to get what it's like to get better. Gotcha, man. So you're feeling like the heart pain, the chest pain, right? Mm -hmm. How did that all come about? Like what all started it? I think being in school and kind of getting through boards has like really caused it. The stress and anxiety has really brought it up. Right. But like <clears throat> for the most part, getting close to the finish line and then figuring out what to do after is also just upstarting <laughs> it even more. <laughs> no, I feel you, man. So, yeah. I was in your same shoes and a lot of us have been in your shoes too. I mean, school, I mean, some people don't know, like we take about five board exams on top of the bajillion of exams that we have already in school. Yeah. So the national board exams, which, you know, you're taking all these classes, you're doing all these things. And on top of that, you take these national exams so you can be a chiropractor when you graduate and not wait till afterwards. Yeah. You know, that whole thing stress really comes down to your body and although you're a chiropractic student you're not immune to pain <clears throat> you're not immune to all these things happening to you right yeah especially when you're in school, sure. you have so much stuff going on with you yeah so i mean how do you feel like everything has been affecting you now honestly it's just kind of like a load is still on the shoulders uh since i'm getting close to the finish line hopefully it'll like go away but i know that i still have you know a lot to offer and i just want to like get myself in a better headspace at the moment just because it's been very taxing <clears throat> these last couple of years with like school and, and life and you know now i just want to get you know in a better place at the moment i feel you man that's mm -hmm. how i'm happy for you because you're making the right decision right as any other patient that comes in here yeah just making the decision and commitment to receive the care that you need to reach the goals and serve how you want to serve mm -hmm. right so how do you feel like it's affecting you like emotionally physically yeah. mentally uh it's very taxing for sure emotionally but like physically i'm just like i feel drained a lot more more than like usual socially it's just like sometimes it's very hard for me to get uplifted but you know i have a an amazing girlfriend so it helps out a lot um, as far as like everything just feeling on top of my shoulders the emotional component the chemical process of it everything just feels like it's boiling inside wow. so the release of it is just very taxing at the moment I feel you man mm -hmm. I mean, you're gonna get through it it's just it's, you gotta take it day by day yeah. and then at one point you reach that finish line and your body's gonna be like finally give up and then just kind of like like over everything that's been weighing so heavy on you yeah okay I feel so, that time I'm is ready. <laughs> awesome, man. <laughs> so the time is coming here for you. You gotta be patient and let your body kind of just do its thing, okay? Mm -hmm. So I'm glad you're here, and we're gonna get you better. All right. I'm ready for it. So let's start off with the range of motion of your neck. Let's have you look to the left as far as you can. Oof. How does that feel? <laughs> Not good. <laughs> Not good at all. <laughs> where do you feel that pain, or what do you, uh, you feel in there? Like right in this area right here. So right in like the T2, T3, T1 and everything? Yeah, it just feels like it's very tight and then something feels like it's pulling. Okay, and now we'll go to the other side. So that one's easier? Easier, but I still feel a pull and the tightness Same still on this there. left side. Right. Okay. Look up as high as you can. That one is very restricted. And even your yeah. face kind of like, you're like, mm. <laughs> it's It's harder to go up with it <clears throat> just because it feels very locked. 
What do you, is the same place or do you feel upper? Um, it's kind of like upper and then that same place. Okay. Like that entire area just feels like it won't let me go back. So I'll tell you this, the reason why you feel that way is because when you have zero curvature in your neck, everything's already stacked up like this. So normally your, your back, your neck's supposed to go like this already, mm -hmm. like normal C curve. Yeah. But when everything's stacked up, it just kind of bunches up and stacks up on each other like this. And it locks up like that. Yeah. Okay. So let's have you look down. Any pain, tension, tightness? No, uh, feels kind of okay, but still <laughs> a little bit of a pulling sensation on this left side. Okay, so that left side is this side right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now let's have you stand up and take a step forward. Good, go down and touch your toes. How does that feel? Fine. Fine, okay. Yeah, no pain. No pain? Uh, and then let's have you keep this leg straight, lift it up as high as you can. How's that feel? Um, a little tight. In like lumbars, yeah, pelvic? Yeah, like somewhere in this area. Okay, and then do this one here. <clears throat> Easier or harder? Uh, felt harder. Felt harder, right? Yeah. <laughs> Atlas, which is the first bone of his neck, shifted forward and kind of upwards this way. So we're gonna come in here with the lift and we're gonna bring that one down, okay? okay. As you were saying, Atlas focuses a lot on like focus, sleep, heart rate, blood pressure, have you been having any of those issues? Blood pressure for sure, sleep for sure, <clears throat> loss of sleep. Loss of sleep? Mm -hmm. Because of this whole pain? Yeah. Okay, and also focus, right? Right. So how, do you, how has that been affecting you? Like, what do you notice in the focus? Um, so memory is just very hard for me at the moment. Mm -hmm. So my girlfriend has to help me remember a lot of things. Oh my goodness. Um, as far as like focusing, schoolwork has just always been there. So mm -hmm. I've been just kind of like zoned in when I have to do something. Yeah. But like the minimal things and <clears> just like <throat> having to do this or this will just like slip out of my mind very okay. easily. And sleep, I mean, if I get somewhere around mm -hmm four to five hours of sleep, I'll wake up. Before it used to be just fine, mm -hmm. and now it's just way harder for me. Okay. Like I'm just very drowsy, groggy, and I just, I just can't do it. That sounds awful, dude. I mean, so you have yeah. already a lot of stress on you and you can't yeah. sleep. I mean, yeah. just add on to the laundry list, right? I know. Let's <laughs> end, let's end all of that, okay? All right, so here's Atlas. Here's shifted forward. You feel that right there? Yeah, it's tender. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll stop doing that. Yeah. And then this side here, we're gonna push this occiput this way and it's stuck. Okay, mm -hmm. and we're going this way. Has a little bit more gif. So, we're gonna start off with this atlas first here, okay? Mm -hmm. Touch your head this way. I'm gonna go this way here. So. The nice thing about chiropractic students, they do really well at relaxing. There it is. Oof. Oof. I felt that one. Oh yeah, dude. I'm getting kind of sweaty at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> That's that parasympathetic yeah. response. <clears throat> <laughs> wow. Yeah. That's been the adjustment you've been needing, honestly, since chiropractic school started. Yeah. I mean, I think I'm gonna cry. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna Why? cry. Because <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> it just felt like a lot of relief. And it was nice. Yeah. <clears throat> it's like that calm, soothing thing yeah because i mean when your body's just like go 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 right yeah and you've just been like in acceleration the gas pedal has been on the whole time and your body finally gets like that rest your body's like man i missed this yeah. what do you think was the last time you felt like this relaxed how you are right now <sighs> since my buddy adjusted me in clinic jeez probably july yeah but yeah that was the last time and so it's been a very long time but that was very much needed for sure, dude. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, I'm glad you have, I mean, not only just me too, but you have your girlfriend over there too. Yeah, she's you been know? a phenomenal <laughs> support. I love her a lot. Yeah, man, it's good to have people around you that can support you in this in this journey. It's, it's tough. Yeah. You know, some people don't understand what doctors go through with school and everything. It takes a whole toll on you. Yeah. And your body just stays on gas pedal the whole time. And then you're, you know, you're pushing to all these things. 
and your body's like once it finally gets that release it's like <sighs> for okay. sure yeah but i can definitely breathe a lot better and i'm way more relaxed at the moment That's i good, just feel man. very like sleepy <laughs> <laughs> yeah very sleepy i think your body finally like your brain finally registered i haven't rested even yeah. though you know you haven't rested your brain finally is like like I haven't rested. For sure. But I want the rest. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was actually it. Uh, Today was just the Atlas. <laughs> how do you feel like it's changing like even like your like how you carry yourself with like your motivation, with your energy? My like, mood has definitely been a lot more different. Mm -hmm. I've noticed that because I haven't had a lot of time to get adjusted and kind of be in an environment to where I wanna be right now, mm -hmm. this here in this moment, that relief from that one adjustment just made it all just seem like it was way better like i just feel at a much better place right now mentally <clears throat> in a sense you kind of feel like more grounded yeah way more grounded all way right. centered Whew. you can feel it in your kind of your body's vibration too when you came in here his body was like vibrating like here it's like super just like too much energy that's not going anywhere it's just kind of staying all the way here yeah but now your body's like here in this moment <sighs> all right Occiput. Good. So here, we gotta find that spot where your body just really releases and lets go. Wow. 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 Whew. That was like an awakening. It was. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Holy cow. Uh, I just feel much more brighter. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cow, that's crazy. <laughs> oh, that's a, different, that's a different type of adjustment I've ever felt. Dude, that's awesome. <sighs> I feel like everything's just kind of going through me at the moment. I don't mm -hmm. really know how to just comprehend it. The computing part is just not going through my head. <laughs> I mean, your body can't process it when it has like school, boards, everything. Yeah. Life in general too. Life in it's general too, man. all there. What's kind of been going on with life though? I mean, something specific or? I think it's just maybe my family. You know, my mom, she came here. Yeah. Uh, she recently got surgery for something that I wanted uh, Dr. Pinto to help her out with, but yeah. she's very one-minded, one-sided, and I felt like I failed her in a way because mm -hmm. I tried getting her chiropractic help for many of years, Yeah. Um, but I couldn't. Um, I found chiropractors to do it. It's just for me to get her to continue care was the hard part. She got very nervous and scared of all the popping and cracking and yeah. she didn't want to go by herself. But it was hard for me to go from Dallas to here because I couldn't do it a lot. Mm. So to be here mm. for her was very hard. So, yeah. She's doing so, better now though? Well, she got surgery, you know, and she's just taking it day by day right now. So, but I do hope and pray that she, you know, will get to a point where she's at peace. Yeah. And she's feeling a little bit more comfortable. Awesome, man. I mean, we'd yeah. love to, <clears throat> I mean, some people, I mean, we, it's, it's hard to convince some people, right? Yeah. Uh, sometimes you kind of just plant a seed in them and eventually it kind of comes to their mind. So I'll tell you a story with my dad where he actually got like very emotional too when I adjusted him because mm -hmm. he had been in so pain, neglected like chiropractic care. And then he finally, when I adjusted him, he was like crying because like, he was like, wow, I've never felt this good before. And it takes time and, and it like, as us as doctors, like we're like, man, like, we want to help so much. Yeah. But when you can't convince someone, you know, it's, it's rough. But just know that, like, regardless, like that innate intelligence that we know about, right? Mm -hmm. the, the energy that, that made the body heals the body. The body. Mm -hmm. So it's flowing through her still. Yeah. She'll be okay. All right. I know. Oh, I'll, I'll keep it in for sure. For sure, man. All right, man. We're gonna work here with your ribs now, okay? Okay. Rib one, rib two. Because a lot of the things you're having here too is because of the bunching up and the twisting you have in that spine. Mm -hmm. So your ribs tend to get misaligned there. So we're gonna go right into rib two here. A little tender, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. So a big thing actually, and a good educational piece here is gonna be that even the muscles that go from like the neck here, they attach to the ribs. So when we correct all the curvatures and we correct the tension that's been here in the neck, all these muscles relax more so your lungs can expand because your ribs can also expand more. So wait, I don't, I actually, I don't know. How did you get into chiropractic? 
I actually got into a car accident where I oh. fell asleep behind the wheel. Um, I went through physical therapy after surgery and they let me go after two weeks. Jeez. They said they couldn't do anything more just mm. because the scar tissue had already hardened mm -hmm. and there was nothing else they really wanted to do. So they gave me at home exercises and range of motion work to do and yeah. it just wasn't getting any better. So I That's had what a, that is right here? Yeah, I had a radius and ulna compound fracture. Ooh. All throughout here they put two rods and then screws in each of these fingers and then there's around 25 screws supporting the rods and the bones. Wow. But I went to a chiropractor because I had no mobility, still yes. no range of motion. And, you know, after getting adjusted for, I went through four months of care of just straight adjusting mm -hmm. on my wrist, my upper extremity. I now am able to adjust and get more motion. Man, so, dude, that's, a, that's quite a story, honestly. Yeah. I feel like something like that would actually kind of make you not want to do this kind of work because you broke something that's really important to what we do here, right? Right. But you still found like that, that drive to say like, that's not going to stop me. Right. Absolutely. So this here is going to accentuate that curve that there is a lack of here. Okay, cool. So Eddie, let's go to the front again here. Look to the left as far as you can. Whoa. A lot better. <laughs> a lot better. <laughs> yeah, not bad. Do you feel anything here now? It's still like a little tight and cool, like right here. Right here. Okay. Um, but it's not as like bad. And your range of motion's increased too. Look to the right here. Uh, that feels way better. That's way better too. Yeah. Alrighty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the beginning, man. <laughs> Left hip here, going forward and also rotating inwards here. We gotta rotate that thing the other way around. Okay. So I'm gonna press on here. The table's gonna come up, all right? Okay. <clears throat> And then we're going to press down in here, just like this. Boom. So now what we do here actually, it's like mirror adjusting. So we look at the x-rays, we see how the whole hips are like in, in place in there. And we, do, we do like the opposite of that. So you can always keep that in mind too when you're adjusting people, is to do like a mirror adjusting for them too. How do you feel like even like the heart is feeling right now, like the chest? Uh, I'm gonna be honest, it feels way better. Like I don't have any heart pain at the moment. My chest doesn't hurt as much. Dope, dude. That's what it's all great. about. This one's gonna go above your head here. Gonna give you that nice stretch. Okay. So here, I already got it. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't take much at all. <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> that was nice. That was good, Thank man. You. Ready for the other side? Yeah. You're going to be doing this here soon, man. Oh. You're going to be serving people, healing spines, changing people's lives, dude. Absolutely. It's one of the most rewarding jobs you can ever think of. I love this profession so much. I'm going to drive this one up more because we're going to get right into L5. So compress it in there. Good. So we're gonna do the more like a push. <laughs> I felt that. <laughs> wow. All right, more. <laughs> that virtualistic is gone there. <laughs> yeah, no, I felt that literally just Thunk. Yeah. Like that was perfectly in. That was so specific and great. Yeah. That was awesome. Good Thank stuff. You. Thank your body too, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So here we got T3, T2, right here. So this is your main triple area here. So if we go right into it, oh, this is going to be like butter. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, that was, tough. that was it. Holy <laughs> sh <sighs> oh. Wow. <laughs> I'll be honest, I don't have it anymore. <laughs> oh, it's not there. Definitely not there anymore. Wow. That's crazy. Right? It's... Dude. Wow.
Ooh, I try not to cry again. <laughs> that was a lot. Just let it out, man. Because, I mean, you store a lot in you. And I think this is part of the healing process, as you know, is going through your emotions, too. Letting the process. Yeah. Kind of shake you right now a little bit, trying to process everything. Yeah, I just feel it all. Just it, that one just went all the way to my feet. That's like, crazy. Like, my body is just, like, it's, it's going nuts. I don't know what it is. But it feels great. Breathing doesn't hurt. That's it's crazy. It's not there anymore. This doesn't feel sensitive at all. So now open and lift up your head. Open? Yeah. Oh. And then, there you go. Oh, this is the water strap. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard of it, never had it done. Yeah, it's, it's super beneficial, man, when you have, um, I mean, everything you have going on with you. So this is gonna open up all the spaces, but especially in the neck. So all the focus issues, the memory, the neck pain, the shoulder pain too. It's gonna help alleviate all that tension in there. You may feel it all the way down to the low back. So, if you feel, do you feel this around like two, T2, T3? <laughs> Let it out. Wow. Oh, everything's so much brighter. <laughs> it's an HD now. Oh, yeah. Wow, I felt that all the way into that spot. Oh, shoot. <sighs> no, but it just felt like it just all opened and then now it's just gone. Exactly. Like that was that second one. Man. Whew, that's a huge breath. And no pain with it, too. <sighs> oh, good sleepy. <laughs> All right, lights out. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah, that was it. Thanks, good, man. What's up, man? I appreciate it. For sure, dude. Take your time. I mean, kind of what's going through your body, what's going through your mind, just with everything that's been going on with you. I know it's a lot to process. I'm going to be honest, I can't really process anything. That's fine. You'll process it when you get home, too. Yeah. And make sure you do, because that's part of the healing process for your body, too, as you know. It has, your nervous system has to understand what's going on. So you need to give it also, like allow it to get, have that time to be like, okay, this is my new body now. Honestly, it just feels like a new body. It like is. I don't have any, my self-awareness is just all right here and <clears throat> like in unison. Like I just feel like everything is joyful, happy. That's beautiful, man. <sighs> Being at peace right now is just, is just great. Like I'm, I'm at my most centered right now. Just wow. being right here in the moment. I don't ever want to get adjusted by anybody again. <laughs> Other than you, obviously. <laughs> <I> gotcha. <laughs> All right, man. <sighs> Lift this leg up. Oh, wow. That's huge. Yeah, no pain. No pain. The other uh, one. That's good too. <laughs> no pain at all. <laughs> no pain at all either, right? <laughs> That's good stuff, man. I feel like I just got a little taller. You probably did. <laughs> yeah. So let's look to the right here now. Whoa. How does that feel? Great, no pain. No pain? No. Other side? Ooh. No pain at no all. No pain either. at all there? No. There we go. Eddie, let's come to the side over here. Look up as high as you can. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I just knew that was way more. <laughs> oh. That's wow. beautiful, man. That yeah. is absolutely beautiful. It feels great, I'll tell you. Now let's wow. have you look down. Let's see that one too. Wow. That feels great too. And then let's have you stand up. <clears throat> awesome, dude. That was great. Man, dude, like I said, give your body like, a nice pat in the back because it's been going through a lot, man. Yeah. So I can see it like, in your body, like what you're going through with school, with your mom, with a lot of these things, right? Yeah. So like walking in and seeing the difference now, what do you feel has been the most different? Everything just feels a lot more joyful. I feel like everything is here. Like it just feels very wholesome and unison. Man, and it's dude, great. That's yeah. huge, man. I'm very happy and smiley at the moment. <laughs> <Yeah, man. laughs> I was happy and smiley when I came in because I was excited to see you guys. But like, <laughs> this just made it that much more better for me. Come to the line room. Fantastic experience. <laughs> awesome, man. Holy cow.